yes, you would learn some theory, but you would actually get hands-on in practice. But in the 19th century, we also learned that in addition to apprenticeship, we could teach art to the earliest possible ages to children in kindergarten or, or, you know, when they were five or six, they would teach, you know, finger painting and then they would teach storytelling and then they would teach, you know, how to make sculptures out of clay and, and whatever, such that we didn't expect all those young students to actually become artists. Some of them would realize, oh my gosh, I have a passion for this. This could be a career. But the others would appreciate how hard it was to actually make something of value. That analogy, I think, applies to entrepreneurship. 